Hi, I'm Ian Simpson, professional poker player and ambassador to 888 Poker. I've been playing poker professionally for 10 years now, mainly focusing on tournaments both online and live. Although poker is played the same, whether you're playing at a computer or with real cards and chips, there are some adjustments you have to make when transitioning from the online arena to the live arena. Here are five tips to help you do just that. Calculating the pot size. One big difference between live and online poker is that it's up to us to calculate the size of the pot. In online poker, as the pot increases, the software calculates and displays this for you, so no math is necessary. When you play live, you get no such luxury, so it's important to keep a mental tally of the size of the current pot. This will allow you to get your bet sizes right throughout the hand. Remember, the dealers are there to help you, so if you lose track of the pot, you can ask them to spread it out so that you can count it up again. The one chip rule. If you're new to live poker, there'll be rules you're not familiar with. One of these is the one chip rule. Let's say some of your table raises to 400 and you throw in a single 1000 denomination chip. This will be ruled as a call. This will be true no matter what single chip you throw into the pot. To make it clear what you want to do, vocalize your intentions. Say I raise to 1000 or say I call. This is because verbal declarations are binding. Adjust to a slower pace. When first playing live poker, you'll notice there is a much slower pace of play compared to online poker. This is largely because shuffling and dealing has to be done manually by the dealer instead of automatically by the computer. When the pace of play is slow, it can be easy to become distracted either by your phone or by whatever sports are on the TV. Don't fall victim to this. Focus on what the other players are doing even when you're not involved in the hand. This is because you could pick up on their betting patterns or even their live tells. Know your stack sizes. When playing live, there isn't a display showing you your opponent's stacks. So before you play the hand, take a look around at your opponent's stacks and your own so you're prepared for later streets in the hand. It's in the rules that chips must be stacked in easily countable piles of 10 or 20 where possible and that your biggest denomination chips are visible. You're well within your rights to ask an opponent to sort out their messy stack or you can ask a floor manager or a dealer to get it sorted out if needs be. Be aware of live tell. Live tells are a big part of what separates online poker from live poker. If you're new to the live felt, try not to worry too much as most people overestimate their ability to read live tells. If you're worried about giving anything away, then when you're active in a hand, try to act consistently with all your movements. Put your chips into the pot in the same way each time and stare at one particular spot on the table whilst you're waiting for your opponent to act. This will make it harder for them to get a read off of you. And don't be chatty while you're in the middle of a hand. For more strategy tips, make sure to subscribe. 888 Poker, made to learn, made to play.